uh, there is globalization and uh, the communication uh, possibilities of communicating is they're more easier and you you just can take a mobile phone and talk to anyone or you just can log on in on facebook and and know what is happening and talk to people but i think with this huge possibility of communicating the, the actual communication is becoming lesser and lesser because uh, we can't handle that kind of uh, excess uh, communication possibilities and i think that's the the, the biggest problem of this world today uh, is uh, you have means to communicate but you have you don't have uh, the real communication and uh, I and so in, in 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 that sense also i feel that india is still unique it's not uh, i'm very happy that uh, you know like that the, the kind of diversity which india has is uh, is very very unique i have i've traveled because of like festivals and uh, when when i'm showing films to europe like when i came here in 2000 in europe every every city was looking different like paris was looking different and uh, and frankfurt was looking different and uh, amsterdam was looking different I, when i came in 2004 then all the streets were looking the same with the same uh, uh, like shops and this body shop and then this and that so like i think we should cherish our uh, diversity and uh, and still communicate and still be friends and still be, be closer and that's what i i really miss when i come outside india and in india of course it's not that uh, it's not changing uh, all the multi cities the, like the mega cities are looking alike but the the real india is is, is still a little away from from the main cities like bombay and uh, and that's uh, that still has its own uh, uniqueness about uh, about being and i really like uh, love to be in india and to to experience all these different uh, cultures and different languages and uh, and that's i feel that that should be a part of the indian cinema as well and which should be communicated and which should be which should come out and it's happening it's it has started happening there is a film called patang the kite uh, which which is uh, on the um, on the kite flying in in ahmedabad or there is a, f a film uh, which is uh, made uh, like two years back it's called harish chandraji factory it's about the experience of uh, first film being made in india uh, 100 years back like this year it's the 100th year of indian cinema and uh, so so this film talks about that so and every language they have they're making something which which is unique about their own existence about their own uh, uh, being and that's uh, but, but the thing is that is not like you know released outside india so much and uh, though sometimes just in festivals but uh, the notion of indian cinema outside india uh, even for a of an independent film is is very different because europe wants to see india in a particular light and if the film breaks that norm then they don't uh, want to see that so i i often feel that and it's also changing but uh, i i feel that uh, it will change when they start really looking at Indian independent films with an open arm, um, with an open point of view.